Hi everybody, it's Noelia with My Moxie Dreams. Thanks for joining me today. Today's video is going to be closing out last week, which I believe was week 22, and setting up week 23 in my everyday carry. Now for those who do not know, I have a Motrim Lux 2.0, and 30 mil rings in caramel. This is one of many covers that I have, but this is the one that I'm in this month, kind of lately. And then my guts, this is what I call my guts. This is Franklin Covey compact size. So I am a Franklin Covey girl, whether people agree with that or not. <laughs> If you are new here, welcome. Thanks for joining me today. If you enjoyed this kind of content, I would love it if you would like and subscribe to my channel. For everybody else, welcome back. Let's dig in, shall we? Now today's Monday per usual. I could have done this video yesterday, but I was being lazy and I'll tell you why here shortly. But first let's log our Monday in our pocket moleskin just because now that I'm doing these, weekly closeouts of the previous week and setting up the current week, it is beneficial for me to just tackle Monday with you. So today is Monday, you guys, 79. I didn't sleep well. Today is going to be a little, it's sunny, but it's overcast a little bit this morning. We are going to do a YouTube video this morning and then we have to work, you guys. I'm not going to edit this until later. I slept in. Priority is HFO QB accounting. I will do the banking here shortly. And then let's go in here. Today is what? Is today the third? Five, six, seven, eight. So I'm just above eight. All right, that's it for this guy. We'll put that away and then we'll bring out I always forget to put her in, but she's just going to be there for beautiest looks for you guys. I sound horrible. Just so everybody knows, I'm just so tired. I'm not fully awake right now. Do you realize that I say that every time? Am I like always half asleep when I do these videos? Gee whiz, Noelia. All right, let's go to last week. Here we are prepping, closing out last week and prepping for this week. So as you can see here, my week was kind of chill. I have errands to run that I didn't get to run. There was just a lot going on. And then I have credit cards that I'm still waiting for to come in. So we're just going to kind of play around. I did some of these for meal plans. So we'll set that aside. And then let's do our accounting, you know, closing out the weekly spending. And as you can see here, there is zilch, zero, nada. Why? Because I had to cancel all my cards. If you've been on the saga of me doxing myself, I had to cancel all my cards last Tuesday. And so for the entire week, I didn't have any charges because all my cards or the cards that I used the most were canceled and I couldn't use anything. So there was nothing to charge. And I was thinking back, like maybe on Monday I charged, but I didn't because I purchased everything for Memorial Weekend on Sunday, Saturday and Sunday. So all the spending was last week. So I have a zero for the first time. Who knew you guys that in order for me to not spend, I just need to cancel my cards. Who knew? So let's go to finances. And week 22 is zero. We're going to take May out now because we're set up for. And then let's go to our money. Week 22, zero. Everybody's going to be like, this is an anomaly. How is this even possible? Well, folks, because all my when I don't have access to my cards, I can't use my cards. So this is gonna go all the way down and we're not even gonna highlight it because I didn't spend anything. That's gonna look so funny. We're all gonna look back when we're at like the end of the year and be like, what the heck, Noelia? And we'll all remember my dorkiness and me releasing my info by accident. All right, we're gonna toss this now because everything that we needed for May has now been logged and that is donezo. There's nothing else that needs to be done in our finances because I already did it. 
I started taking my B12 again, you guys, so you should be proud of me. Let's go to my daily banking and just show that we did it. All right, so now we're gonna take these out and we're gonna move our current week. Why am I taking those out? You see, I'm being a nut. Let's just put our current week where it's supposed to be with our divider. And we're not taking these out, we're putting this back here because we need to keep that. Okay, so now let's get our color out. I kind of like just the nude, the sand color. It's my favorite color, it's neutral, it's pleasing to my eye, and it's not anything major. I can take this out now because I really don't need it. So yeah, last week having no credit card forced us to, forced me to make dinner and not eat out, which was great. The only day we ate out, and we'll do that right now after we set up the week, is we do a breakfast with my mom a couple of times a month. And so we went out yesterday to breakfast with my mom. Okay, and that's actually what I need to do there's my reminder of what I need to do today. Um, let's get our stickers and let's find our... So this is going to be a quick video, I think, you guys, because we don't have a lot to kind of do. So we're putting mom... We already went to breakfast, so I could put this one back in the to-do. do 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 Okay, and then we're going to put family breakfast. So we have, as you guys know, I live in a beautiful wine country. And we have Michelin star restaurants. We have, because there's so much tourism, we have some of the most amazing, you know, places to eat, restaurants and little hidden gems here in the valley. And so, is there anything else? No, it's just we need to prep the week. And so I, I need to put, what is happening there? Oh, 4 p.m. Okay, before we go into what I'm doing, what I'm going to do this week is kind of something different, is I want to put the, the expected temperatures and the only reason I want to do it this week is because it's going to be freaking hot this week it yesterday it was saying that we we're going to be like 101 this week and then this morning when I checked it it's going to be a little bit lower but still in the high 90s so I'm just going to put this up top where the color is just so that when I open my um, planner when it's open on my desk and right before I go to bed I know what it's going to be like so that I can prep for the cats. Like for instance, um, when I know it's going to be super hot that week, I make sure that the cats have their, their food, their wet food in the refrigerator so that when they, they eat, it's nice and cool for them and it's refreshing for them. And then I just make sure that I keep the house cool and stuff like that, which I'm sure. So this is a trying situation. And again, I think it's just for this week. I can tell you already, I don't like it. <laughs> okay, so again, I'm used to certain things in my planner. This is, it's really hard for me to adjust to change. But so I, yeah, I think maybe that probably wasn't a good idea for me. Maybe what I need to do is something like this where I create, you know, how I created this little sticker schedule for Belle. Maybe I need to create this for the summer that just says weekly temps and have it here on my little divider tab because already I can see that this is going to this is going to be a problem for me because I'm used to having that line blank. So I can tell you right now, again, this is so you guys can see how my mind works. I can tell you right now, I'm going to have to reprint this off camera and do it different. But 
for the sake of this, <laughs> we're going to keep going just because, um, see, I don't know what's going to trigger me visually until it's there. This morning, I thought it'd be a great idea to have it, have the temperatures here. And I really do want it where I can visibly see it. But at the same time, having it here is not a good place. Maybe I should put it in the bottom and then have Bell's work hours somewhere else. I don't know. I'm going to have to play around with it. But for, for now, that's where it's at. So the sixth, we have a appointment. And then we have another appointment. That's going to be a Zoom. And that's pretty much it. I'm praying to the heavens that I do not have to meet my bosses this week. I'm sure they're going to want to meet me next week because we just met this week. We'll see. We have a lot going on. Okay. So then let's go to see. God, I have so many things to do this week. And then it's going to be hot. So you don't want to do it. You know what I mean? I still haven't received this Kaiser check, guys. It's so freaking annoying. I need to WD-40. I'm going to do that today. The seatbelt, the passenger seatbelt on my car squeaks. And it's driving me insane. I need to pick up the mail. I need to go to Ulta because the shampoo that I buy is like freaking a hundred dollars and I should have tried to get a sale over the Memorial weekend. Maybe I have little coupons. Okay, so the cards that I'm waiting for is my ATM, my FSA, HRA, and HV expense. Those are the four that I'm waiting on now. Do I need to call anybody? YouTube drama. It wasn't YouTube drama. It was me doxing myself drama. Yeah, nerd. Okay, so I think that's it for now, right? There's nothing. I have my food. We made chili cheese fries last night. They were so freaking good. I got to kind of redo this because it's going to be so hot to be, to cook like warm foods, but some of these are Belle's favorite, so we'll see what happens there. All right, I think that's it. Let's go to our to-dos to just see if there's anything I need to carry over. I do need to go to the car wash, you guys. I need to wash my car. It's funny because Belle's been driving to work in her vehicle, and it's so funny because she parks it around the corner. If you guys have been with me for a long time, we purposely park it in front of Jimbo's house if you haven't seen that, there's a video, I think it's a plan with me, and it says, I don't know, parking drama or something. It's a funny video because it tells you about what happened with my neighbor. He's not really my neighbor, but whatever. For those of you that remember, Belle parks her car right in front of Jimbo's house. Not like in front, but across the street. So the other day I was passing by her car and her windows were horrendous. And I'm like, girl, you need to go wash your windows. So she brought in the car yesterday and washed her windows. It was funny. She should have washed her entire freaking car, but she didn't. Oh crap, I need to, oh my God. I need to prep second quarter expense report because we're already at the end of June, right? January, February, March, April, May, June. Yeah, I have to prep that, sweet Jesus. Um, Anything else here that I need to, oh, I need to do the curtains, the dining room. It's so funny. I don't, I think it's, who is it? I think her name is Patty. I follow her on Instagram. I love her. She she makes me giggle because she writes in her planner, which if you see my writing, right? You see that I don't, sometimes I'm writing so fast. And this one, remind, every time I see this repair dining, I, didn't, I don't know what it says. Now I know it says repair dining curtains, but I can never read that. And I always think of Patty because she had posted something. It's, it looked like Amish or something. It was so funny. And every time I see that specific line item, I think of Patty on Instagram. I'll leave her handle somewhere. She's a sweetheart. Okay. So I need to repair the dining, dining room curtains. And again, want to know why? Cause there's big holes drilled in there. 
And again, I watched something on Instagram, which I guess is birthed from TikTok, because you know how I don't have TikTok. So TikTok, people take their TikToks and then they bring them into Instagram. So I watched something and it was a girl who had, when the rod is coming loose because the hole is loosening and she had, this is not, I'm just sharing because I think it's so funny. You wet these little plaster things and you wrap them around the little screw and then you screw it in and you wait and it's supposed to like harden because it's plaster. So we'll see if it works. I'll keep you guys posted next week. And then my son, thankfully he fixed my patio door because it was broken. Or not broken, but loose. Okay, so hopefully I can get that done. Hopefully I can update. I get the cards this week. Update my credit card sheet. And update subs with the correct credit card. Those are super important this week. Um, okay, trackers. I watched Parlay last night. I watched something good, did I? I think I watched a documentary. That is already, and then there's nothing else, I don't think. Everything has been, June is now here. My health, I finally got back on track. Look at, I was, I stopped for almost a week and a half. So I'm back on track there. Finances are ready to go. We have bills due this, this week. So I gotta calculate. Banking is done. There's nothing impersonal. I think we're caught up, you guys. I think that's it, right? I think we're done for the week, for week 23. We're all set up. Just a heads up, I plan on doing a bonus video probably sometime this week and I'll release it on Friday or Saturday morning. I never know which. So just make sure that you have your notifications on so you know which one, when that drops. But that's gonna be a planner tools frequently asked questions. Once I do that video, I'm going to set up a highlight on my Instagram that has all of those questions because they get asked a lot. So that is coming for those of you who've been asking those questions, that is coming. I think I'm also going to choose a theme for July together. We will create the stickers together because I kind of want you to see how that process works. So that won't be coming till later in the month. So I hope those are gonna be interesting videos. Make sure again that you put your notification bell on because I don't know when exactly those two videos, the Frequently Asked Questions Planner Edition and the July theme process will be dropping. So that's that. All right, so thank you for joining me for the closeout of week 22 and the setup of week 23 in my everyday carry. Again, if you are new here, I hope that you enjoy this kind of content. And if you do, I would love it if you would like and subscribe to my channel. For everybody else, as always, it's such a pleasure to spend this time with you. Thanks so much. I hope you have a wonderful week and I will see you next time. Bye.